Pi Data Link from OSI Soft allows you to bring Pi system data into Microsoft Excel. And well, since Excel is the world's tool of choice for numbers, Pi Data Link is a very common tool for OSI Soft's users. Pi Data Link is an Excel add-in. It has a separate install file that's downloadable from OSIsoft.com and installs on top of Excel. Once installed, Pi Data Link appears on the Microsoft Excel ribbon bar. The handful or so of data link functions are available by clicking the ribbon buttons and are configured with easy to use sidebar wizards. Many people use PyDataLink for either building reports or analyzing their process. First, reporting. Before they first use PyDataLink, we often find people copying or pasting or importing raw data from text files. And with PyDataLink, that's completely unneeded. Your sheets update with live data and you can ask for more data anytime. See, I'll ask for an extra day here and the spreadsheet updates with my new request. I use this to create reports. At the end of every day, I open my report spreadsheet and Pi Data Link replaces yesterday's data with today's data and I email it off. I have a single spreadsheet template for all of my heat exchanger assets and all I need to do is select the heat exchanger from this drop down list and my spreadsheet calls the data for that heat exchanger. It's all from a single spreadsheet and I save the time I would otherwise spend collecting and formatting data from all over the plant. Next, analysis. So there are many native Microsoft Excel functions that are very powerful for analyzing data, but they just aren't designed with time series data in mind. And that's the type of data that the Pi system collects from your process. So for instance, say I have these sensor readings for the past 24 hours. If I want to see the maximum sensor reading every hour and what time that reading happened, Pi Data Link has a function for that and can quickly tell me. To do the same thing with the native Microsoft Excel function, I would need to divide the raw data by hour, run a different maximum calculation for each hour, and then cross-reference with the raw data to find the time that that maximum happened. And well, that's a lot of steps that PyDataLink can do in one step. And what's more, if all I want to see are the maximum hourly sensor readings, I don't even need all the raw sensor data on my sheet at all. I can clear it away, and now my spreadsheet files are much smaller and calculate much faster without all that raw data. The bottom line is Pi Data Link puts Pi system data in Excel. As a bonus, spreadsheets run faster with smaller file sizes and I have special functions for working with all of my time series process data.